In this video, we're going to have a look at the trial balance. So, trial balance is the final step um, after you do the journal and ledger. You you uh, post to the trial balance, and it's basically just a check uh, to see if your debits and credits are equal. If they're not, that means you've made a mistake. So, it's just a quick check at any point in time to see if your data is accurate and reliable. So to um, post from a ledger to a trial balance, all you do in order of accounts is you list your accounts. So the first account here from our ledger was our sales revenue account. So account number 1101, sales revenue was the name, sales revenue, and its final balance, its final rallying, running balance was 4800 uh, credit. So we're going to put in a credit column for 800. Then we go to the next account. The next account was 1101A sales returns. So 1101A sales returns. Now the final balance of that was 100 debit. So I'm going to put 100 in here. And then we just keep going. So the next one, the account number was 2105 cost of goods sold and the final running balance was 2250 debit so 2250 basically what you do is you just keep going down I've just cut the rest of this question um, because it's too long and I don't want you to uh, do all that but basically you just keep running down once you're finished you add these two numbers uh, these two columns up so 4800 and that's 2350. So they should be equal. If they're not equal, that means you've made a mistake somewhere and you need to go back and try to find where that mistake is. Sometimes by calculating the difference, it might help you narrow down or track down your mistake. That's it, guys. That's the trial balance.